All right, so I have things set up. I'm importing my object. I've got my patient with the head, mandible, uh, text specifying the location, skull, ventricles. I've got things set up uh, as far as rotation goes, scaling, um, origins, both for the things as a whole and for individual items. Uh, one of the things I'm thinking about next is I do need to look at the vertex counts. So I'm going to look at my overlays, my viewport overlays, and I'm going to go to statistics and check that box. And we can see that I have 1,028,576 vertices in this scene. I've dealt with more, uh, but that's still, it's a lot especially if I need these models to be performant in certain scenarios. So let's give that some consideration. I'm going to start with the head, right, which we just renamed. We'll see how that works, and then we'll take a look at some of these other items because I think they will provide some unique challenges. So we'll kind of work through this a couple of different times, I think, and see where that takes us. So anyway, we need to specify... I believe the uh, that this is done through the context menu so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that and then I'm going to specify the next thing that I need to do is talk about or decide what the voxel size is gonna be and if you're not familiar with what a voxel is uh, a voxel is basically a three-dimensional pixel and the bigger that voxel is then the more vertices that it'll take up in the uh, in the model so that being the case uh, once we've decided what we want the voxel size to be and that's sort of difficult call uh, it can vary depending on the situation in fact it will vary quite a bit on the situation so I'm going to just go with 3.5 and we'll see where that gets us so let me slide this over here and push play and yes we will have to wait for a couple of minutes okay so things have run and now we can see that the vertices the vertex count in the scene is down to 993,000, which is still a lot but if we take a look at the head specifically that's down to 31,000 vertices and the geometry still looks yeah, pretty decent and if we tab back out and look at it we really haven't lost much detail so i will stop i will let the voxel size be 3.5 on the head and then i guess i will hide the head and we'll take a look at some of these other items shortly